There's a long drive, and it's tied up. What a shot. A rocket by Todd Hundley. And I hope somebody up in the stands was prepared. Bases loaded again for Chicago against Alejandro Pena. And does your Alejandro Pena? You bet it does. Ron Karkavice takes him deep. His fifth career grand slam, the White Sox record. Tied at one, which means the no-hitter was over. Bases loaded. Todd Hundley. That ball is deep, and that ball is gone. Hundley, grand slam off of Brian Eversgird, and the Mets go on to win it 5-1. to one. Top of the third of Dodgers, and the most dangerous Dodger, maybe one of the most dangerous hitters in all of baseball, Mike Pepperoni Piazza. Goes opposite way, but guess what? The power, the mile high, the, the slam. It's 4-4. Four to four. Bases loaded, Walker's aboard. The ultimate revenge. Put that in your ear. Dante Bichette with a grand slam. The Rockies overcome. Certainly not been run. 6 5. Top of the eighth. Same score. Loaded. Brian Johnson. Boom. Over the right field wall. That's a grand slam. That gave the Pods a 9 6 lead. They win 9 7. Heathcliff Slocum in. Bases juice. That's Gary Sheffield. Good wood. Solid spank. Major League. Crank. Grand slam. For Sheffield, we are tied at seven. Extra innings we go. <laughs> then bottom of eight, bases loaded, game tied at two. The pinch hitter is Rusty Greer, and that is a hit in the pinch. Three on, four in. Grand slam. Rangers lead at six to two. Walk Dwight Smith. Grande quadrangular. It's grand slam. Braves won at four nothing. Six career shutout for Steve Avery. Throws it to Tony Eusebio. The base is loaded, the base is unloaded. Hurriedly. That's a grand slam. First home of the year, first grand slam. 10-2, Astros are winning. Tigers, bottom of the first, base is loaded for Cecil Fielder. See you later off Bob Wells. Get out of town. 4-1 Tigers, eighth career grand slam for the big This is Juice Ashby facing Mike Lansing. And you might as well touch them all, Mike. That's your first career grand slam. Four to one Expos. Walks the bases loaded. First Terry Steinbach and Steiny sends it high and deep into the bleachers. Aloha means goodbye. Grand slam for Terry Steinbach. One bases loaded. Nomo out of the game. And here comes Rondell White against Felix Rodriguez. Gone. White's fifth home run on the year. This one's a grand slam. Five one Expos. And that would be your final. Tim Salmon is up next. One, two, three men aboard. And Salmon would take care of that with this. Three men on, four men in. Grand slam. It is a four-all tie. It was 5-4 Angels. Bottom two, Chris Hammond, the pitcher up with the bases loaded. Here it comes. There it goes. Oh, come on. Hammond with a grand slam off of Shane Reynolds. First slam by a pitcher since 86. 4-2 Florida in a flash. Now, top of the ninth inning, Expos up three to one, and bases loaded. Sean Barry unloads a big uh oh. Barry's granny capped the six run ninth inning and locked up for Saros. Lopez hit the beach ball five to one. They bring in Willie Banks. Seven to one, Atlanta. Bases loaded. Bases not loaded. Doc is here. Doc isn't here. Ryan Klesko, grand slam. Could be. Oh, yeah. The grand spank. First career granny for Geronimo, 4 to 2 Oakland. And Mariano Rivera did not have a good start. Fastball belted deep to left field. It is grand salami time for Edgar Martinez. My, oh, my. Part of a nine run eighth. The next pitch, you know, it's. And he's taking notes. Bases loaded in the fourth. <laughs> Grand slam for Mike Stanley. George loves him. Yankees up four to one. In the fifth, but Kirby gets revenge. In the sixth, two out, and the bases are loaded. All you can do is just offer. Here it comes. There it goes. Grand slam for Kirby Puckett. The seventh of his career. Eight to one twins, and the big unit knows it right. Williams is hitting only 133 against righties. Why would Buck do this? Because he knew in his heart of hearts that this was the one time against righties that Gerald was going to hit one out of the park. First ever grand slam. Terrific move from Buck. 7-2 Yank. Safe at the plate. Maybe, maybe not. Blue Jays up 7-6. Top of nine bases loaded. Valentin golfs one off of Mike Timlin. Park does not hold that. Grand slam. And the Blue Jays up 10-8 would win a 10-9. Right now against Alan Trammell. Gone. Right here. Right now watching the world wake up from history. 
Wrong decision. 6-3. No sweat, right? Fastball, he went down and got it. Nagel hits a grand slam. Just his second career home run, makes it into the basket. The inning, Padres up 4-3. Top of six now, base is drunk, and Ken Caminiti sobers him up. Grand slam to right field. That would make it 11-3, and yes, Dodger fans, it would get worse. So there's two outs for Mark McGuire, and I'll bet you a bean 5-1, to he doesn't hit a home run. Are you kidding me, McGuire? Of all things, with two outs in the ninth inning, I would have bet that he wouldn't have done that, but by gummy did. A's win it 8-5. to five. Sox inside, then John Cruck, he doesn't walk him. He hit the ball real hard. The grand slam, his first since 91, 5 nothing Sox, and they would coast from there while the team front office met above. The seventh, 3 nothing pods, bases loaded Eddie Williams. Greeting reliever Doug Brocale. Yeah, that's gone. A grand slam for Williams' second of his career. This one was easy for San Diego. 9-2 the final. Walks Edgar Martinez, and Tino Martinez takes offense to that. Take that, Bud Black. Tino Martinez with his second career grand slam. 9-3 Mariners the final. 2-0 Brewers, bases loaded. Matt Mieske. Matt Mieske with a grand slam off Finley, his first ever grand slam. It was 6 nothing. 2 nothing Mariners in the fourth. John Olderud, who has never hit a grand slam, has the bases loaded. Correction. This just in. This just out. Rafael Carmona is the victim of the grand salami. Again, the base is loaded, and clearly Nitkowski would have loved to walk here. Instead, he gets this from Ray Holbert. Three on, four in. Deep. Grand slam. 8-6. to six. San Diego takes the lead. Still top of eight, two outs. Beck walks two more batters, and so the bases are loaded. Kurt Abbott. Three on, and we've seen this before. Four in, shopping at and over the gap off of Rod Beck, and the Marlins are a winner. Bases are loaded for Tino Martinez, and here it comes. And there it goes. Martinez smacking a 3-2 pitch into the upper deck, a grand slam to end the game in thrilling fashion. Yes, that deserves fireworks as the Mariners do prevail. And the pitch. It's Colburn again. He says, if Barry can do it, I can do it, too. Takes a Chris Hook pitch and deposits it into the bleachers. Grand slam. Marlins up 12-7. And up 4-0 in the second. And then big Mo Vaughn taking Scott Klingenbeck deep. 444 feet to center. The grand slam. Bases loaded for Brett Barbary. He's never had a grand slam in his career until now. Take, make it a 3-2 Kansas City advantage into a 6 Potential walk to Olivero. Well hit, ball deep to left field. Newsom going back to the track, to the wall. Gone. Grand slam, home run by Ed Spray. And the Blue Jays take a 4 nothing lead. Farland's replacement, Bill Hasselman, a developing situation. Way back, deepest part of the ballpark. Hasselman's first career grand slam, his second home run of the year. Caminiti scores, 5-3 Padres. Next batter, Melvin Nieves. Get out of here! Grand slam, 9-3 Padres. And baseball's extra special moment, the grand slam. 17th home run of the year for Sorrento. 10-5 Indians, bottom of the eighth. Two Mariners, bases juiced for Mike Blowers versus Mike Butcher. And baseball's extra special moment, the grand slam, 10-2 M's with the lead. Removed bottom one, bases juiced. Another hole in the Ozo. Boston goes on the 10-2 route. Move on. And Bell make it three to nothing. Then bases loaded and Manny Ramirez unloads. A grand slam home run, his 25th overall. Mike Devereaux gave it all he had, but it was out. Marulo, and with the bases loaded, he would make them unloaded. Deep over the baggie and gone for a grand slam. First home run of the year and a big one, 13 to 4 Twins. Billy Brewer banging his. White Sox, Bennis lasted just three innings. Bottom of the fourth, Jay Buhner unloads. The grand slam to deep center. We're tied at five. Buhner's 20th home run of the year. Bottom of the Mike Stanley. Fastball low, Stanley drills it, dead center, lofted it on the run, he's not going to get it, it's gone! A grand slam for Mike Stanley! Side, bottom of eight now, three to one Rangers, Benji Gill with the bases loaded, and all of a sudden they're not loaded anymore. That is 
Davis. I believe he's gone shopping at Target. What do you know? Eighth home run of the year. The Yankees, sixth inning, bases loaded. That's Ruben Sierra. Had his problems in the outfield. How is he going to do at the plate? It's a shot towards right. We know it's a short porch there and plenty short enough for Ruben. One nothing lead. Sierra with the grand slam. Oh, look at the fan. Take care of yourself. Wins top of seven. Bases loaded for Mike Blowers. He loves it when the bases are loaded. And somebody get Tom Bosley because we need a new baggie. That's up and over. And the Mariners are a winner six to two. This is big mistake. Service wants it inside. Traxel missed the spot. Mondesi does not miss. Gets the ball out over the plate and crushes it. Grand slam. Dodgers take a fourth relay. Day to John Jaha. Would that pay off? I don't think so. You'll walk the bases loaded against John Jaha, and you're going to pay for that every time. Grand slam, 6 nothing. Brewers. And is your batter. Bases loaded, a developing situation. And there it goes. His first grand slam since 1991, the seventh grand slam of his career. It's 5 nothing. Florida. Lewis, bases loaded. And Todd Jones is going to face Ron Gant. Has Gant had a big year for the Reds this year or what? Hanging curve, back, 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 back. A granny. His 26th home run of the year. Two thirds of an inning. Still in the first now. Oscar Munoz on the mound for the Twins. Sacks Jack. Juan Gonzalez. Can I get a witness from the congregation? Past the collection. Played around for a grand slam. Texas led it 11 to nothing. Is loaded. That has to be a developing situation. Tony Gwynn has never before hit a grand slam. First grand slam of his career. Gwynn now with 73 RBIs. This year that's a career high. It's 4-3. Bottom five. Loaded in the fifth. A developing situation. 7-6 fills. Jim Eisenreich. A pinch hit grand slam. The Phillies' first grand slam pinch hit since 1983. And the Phillies win at 12-8. Durham for the double play to help out Jason Bure. And bases loaded for Ray Durham. Sends it high and deep. And aloha means goodbye. His first career grand slam at any level. Going back to Little League even. Means Mets down 2-1. to one. Load the bases in the fifth. Carl Everett facing Willie Blair. Say goodbye. Carl Everett with the drive. And that is a grand slam. The first of his career. Mets take the lead for good at 5-2. to two. About the top of the ninth, Cardinals down 3-1. Bases loaded, Danny Schaefer. Bruce Ruffin hangs a curveball, and Schaefer gives it a ride. A grand slam, Cardinals up 5. Top of the six, bases juiced for Mike Piazza, and he has just entered the zone. Baseball's extra special moment, the grand slam. Piazza's fourth career grand slam, 7-0 Dodgers. Four Indians, Albert Bell facing Mike Myers. Excellent. Cha, as if a bases loaded homer, a four-run job. We like to call those grand slams. And we're not worthy. We're not worthy. This for Johnny Jaha. That ball is hit deep. Off Mike Tromley, a grand slam. Jaha's third of the year, a Brewers record, 4-0 Brew Crew. Bottom of three. That ball hit hard in the right center field. Yes. Way back. They look up. You can put it on the board. Yes. yes. Grand slam home run by Robin Ventura. Got to throw a strike. There it is. And there it goes. Way back it is. Gone. Another grand slam. Robin Ventura. His second in two innings. Kevin Jarvis pitching, bases loaded for Derek May, a developing situation, it's gone. A grand slam, the first career slam, first career slam for May, fifth homer of the year, Astros up 8-1. Stop of the fourth, Expos trail 5-2, bases juiced for David Segui. And this is baseball's version of the slam dunk from the foul line. Yeah, it's the grand slam. 6-5 Expos. Vanderwall, Vinny Castilla, Jason Bates score. Rockies up 5-4. Sacks Jack, Andres Galarraga. Can I get a witness from the congregation? Past the collection, played around. Grand slam home run off of Chuck Mackle. That's what hurt him. He will stay in the rotation. Bases are loaded for Mickey Tettleton. And Joe Sluskarski gets nailed. Tettleton's 26, his sixth career granny. Caught service throwing error. The bases are loaded for Matty Williams. Get out of here. His 18th of the season going the other way. And primetime says, I'm going to stay here until we get knocked out of the playoffs. He's thinking postseason. Bottom of six, 4-1 Orioles. Mariano Rivera in relief of Hitchcock. Bobby Bonilla. Yahtzee, it's out of here. His eighth of the year. 8-1 Orioles lead, and they win it. Coleman, it's a fly ball deep to right field. A 
Another look, Vince Coleman, first career Grand Slam. We are all knotted at six. Situation, bases loaded for Travis Fryman. Grand Slam, his second Grand Slam of the year. Both have come against Boston, his 14th home of the year. Tigers get six runs in the third. And with two outs, Ken Griffey's son. I am amused at the simplicity of this game. And also the delay on the call. Grand Slam for Junior's eighth career Grand Slam. Former starter. And that's hit in the air to left field and over the head of Kelly, who goes all the way back to the track and watches it go on for a Grand Slam. And here comes the 2-2 pitch to Edgar Martinez now. And the fastball swung on and hit the deep center field. Bernie Williams goes back and 